New to Minecraft, the barrel. We can now actually do barrel rolls, maybe? No. Hey guys, it's Chad. On today's episode, we're gonna be taking a look at everything to do with the barrel. That's right, this new block in Minecraft is a new storage block. We love those, so let's take a look at everything. So here we are inside of Minecraft. It's a little bit barren right now, but today we are gonna be taking a look at doot, 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 barrels. They're right here. This is a recipe. Uh, you can use any planks along the side and then oak, any type of slab as the top and bottom. Now for a chest, you need at least two oaks. Then you'll get eight planks and you can make it into a chest. But with a uh, barrel, you need to create the slabs. So you need to use at least three slabs, and then you won't have enough wood to complete the barrel. So overall, it is actually a less expensive recipe because you uh, are using, basically when, it, when you make these uh, six, you, get, you make these three into six, you're doubling up the wood. So it actually requires technically one less oak plank, but you do need to make sure that you have at least three oak logs or any type of log in order to make the barrel. So uh, there you go, that is how you make the barrel. This is what the barrel looks like when you place it down. Uh, it places down the same way that pistons place down in the game, which is unlike how logs are placed down. Basically, the way that you are facing, it will try to determine the uh, way that it should face, just like pistons, where if you stand far back and place down a piston, it'll face towards you. If you place down a piston where you're more pointing down, then it'll do that. Unlike logs, where it will place it onto the face that you click. So if I click right here, the log will point up. That's because I'm clicking the top face of this block. But if I click the side, even though I'm standing in the exact same position, haven't moved at all, it'll face towards me. Um, I kind of like that one better, but whatever. Anyway, that's how you place down these barrels. You can now right click a barrel and it has an inventory. This is a one chest sized inventory. So technically it takes one less plank, even though it's a little bit more difficult to make, uh, to create a barrel and then it has the same space as a chest. I do want to point out that there is a back uh, texture as well. So that is the front texture and that is the back texture. Now one advantage that a barrel would have over a normal chest, you may be asking yourself why would I even use it if they have the same space, is that a chest cannot be opened if there is a solid block on top of it. You can't open that. But a barrel you can because there is no basically chest opening mechanism. Now chests can hold more items as long as they're double chests, which it looks like there's no way to create that same situation with a barrel. Barrels do work the same as chests when it comes to hoppers. Things can be pulled out of hoppers. They can push items into hoppers the exact same way. So if I added those there, it will push it inside. So barrels work the exact same way when it comes to hoppers. Although there is a difference when it comes to redstone in general, and that is the comparator. On a chest, if you compare the output of either of these chests, uh, the moment I put one item in there, that will light up. The moment I put an item in a barrel, it doesn't do the same thing. So that comparator functionality will not work with a barrel. Just like chests, uh, they can be named. So if I say OMG Chad chest uh, right here, same thing can be done with the barrel that you can rename it and you'll be able to see the name on the top of the GUI. So you can see OMG Chad's barrel, OMG Chad's chest, both of those can be renamed in an anvil. Another thing about placement is there is like a little, little stopper on the top. That doesn't matter uh, which way that you're facing, uh, that will always be the same direction. 
Finally, barrels do not make any sound when you open them. So, uh, unlike a chest, which makes that big old uh, barrels are silent. There you go, everything you need to know about the barrel. One thing to note is that we are still in snapshots, so things could change. There is still a chance that they might change. Not until the official release will we know that absolutely everything is locked in place. If you didn't know, snapshots are the development build of Minecraft experimental. We It's like a bad laboratory that we get to look in and peek in on. Thanks so much for watching this episode of OMG Craft. If you enjoyed it, please give this video a like. Make sure you subscribe for future videos, tips, tricks, tutorials, and spotlights. And leave a comment down below letting me know what you're going to put into a barrel. See you next time. Bye.